The top story in this bulletin is of the Prime Minister's security breach in Hubli, where he was on a long road show. Now, what we are getting to understand is that a young boy jumped onto the road suddenly, managed to get within an arm's length of the Prime Minister. This young boy was carrying a garland, trying to felicitate uh, the Prime Minister, hand the garland to him. He was intercepted at the last minute and whisked away by the Special Protection Group of the SPG. The incident happened when the Prime Minister was heading towards the Hubli Dharwar Railway Sports Ground to inaugurate the 26th edition of the National Youth Festival. Meanwhile, huge questions have now been raised on this massive security breach, viewers. I just wanted to know the details about this guy who reached uh, near to the Prime Minister during the road We are examining. Show. We are examining. Huh? And uh, there is no breach as such. And uh, all crowd which has been uh, standing inside the road has properly checked, has been done, frisking has been done, everything has been done to that crowd which is stopping both sides of the road. But the uh, unidentified person reached near the PM convoy, sir. He gave a, a flow of... No, the PM convoy is just... The convoy is very near to barricade only, na? Uh -huh. Yes. So, yeah, yeah. So, we are gathering this issue anyhow. Let us check what is what was this. I want to immediately connect to my colleague Naga Arjuntwar Kanat, who is joining us for the latest. Uh, Naga, what is on suit at the back of this massive security breach and accountability needs to be fixed? Uh, the SPG has a lot of homework to do and possibly, uh, you know, an advisory would be given to the Prime Minister as well, the Prime Minister's office as well regarding the same. But having said that, what are the local authorities saying? Well, that is true, Preeti. Uh, in fact, I spoke to the commissioner, myself, public commissioner. He's given me more details. The boy is of 10 to 11 year old from Darwad. He was over enthusiastic. He jumped the barricade, then gave the garland to the prime minister. Uh, they are not calling it a breach of security or a protocol breach because they say that even the garland was frisked. Every item that reached the location was frisked thoroughly. And we know that this boy was a supporter of uh, Prime Minister Modi and a fan of Prime Minister. He then jumped and gave the garland. They, we, they, we don't see this as a security breach because everyone, lakhs of people were there and the car was very close to the barricade as well. And the garland was not a foreign object because it was thoroughly checked by the security officials. Uh, they have not uh, detained the boy considering his age also. He's just 10 to 11 years old. He was just over -enthusiast, uh, enthusiastic seeing the Prime Minister jumped and then gave the garland. Uh, he's a local person here, so the local police also have information about his family, but they have not taken any action yet in terms of detain and arrest. Uh, the SPG is talking to the local police as well as what we are told, that certain explanation will have to be given, that how did he jump and if he did jump, uh, why was he not stopped? But what we are picking up from our sources also that there was prior permission in the sense when Prime Minister saw him coming, he, would, he, he didn't stop him. He in fact took the garland and put it on the windshield later. All right. Uh, the opposition, the Congress, uh, Naga, has made a political meal out of it with many uh, leaders from the Congress in the Karnataka unit actually blaming the Prime Minister himself for violating his own security protocol. Well, that is true. Uh, the Congress has come out heavily on the Prime Minister saying Prime Minister is not just Prime Minister for BJP but also for India. He is Prime Minister for almost 1.3 billion people. So, Congress is saying his safety is paramount and him standing on the footboard and breaching, uh, trying to be close to the people when it's unsafe, that is not done. He will have to follow what the protocol set by the SPG. Congress is saying this is a security breach and it should not be happening while the police here are saying it is just an over-enthusiastic kid who came and gave the garland.